Can dreams really come true? Can we decide our fate, our destiny? Here, everything is possible. It's time to conquer the world. From disaster to paradise. Welcome to Fire Scar. And hello everybody and welcome back to a brand new episode of Let's Play Fire Scar. My name is Dave and I'll be your host for this episode as always. Today we will go on an epic quest. An epic journey to find the end portal. And I honestly hope that we run into some trouble on the way, otherwise I have no idea what I'm gonna do for the montage at the end of the episode that I always do. I hope something happens. But before we go, let's take a look at what I've done off camera. As always, I've been busy. I've completed the storage room. This is how it looks. I went for a complete different design over here than over here. Um, this is more like a real storage is. It's not all the same way, like in uh, bigger storage facilities. They're not built up symmetric. They're like, we, we need this for that and this for that and let's throw it in a big hall. So things actually look different there. So I thought let's do something different over here than over there. And I like it, but I don't love it. So if you have any suggestions how to change it and what would be better, feel free to suggest. Oh, actually, I think it's this time of year where I want to listen to the in-game music again. So let's put that on. And let's look at the other stuff that I did. I didn't only play down there. I've also built another house and did some stuff in the rivers. I changed out the stuff over there and I uh, tweeted about it. I changed some stuff over at the old lighthouse. Mm -hmm. So let's take a look at that. Um, at first, this is the house that I built. Uh, fits in quite nicely, actually. Looks kind of cool. It's really thin compared to the others. I usually try to stay away from the three wide because like, you, there's only one space where you can put a window or a door, so... Oh, I forgot the slabs. Gotta change that. I also moved the um, reed farm back here. I actually put it there. And I think I want to do that a little bit more inspired by what I did down over there. With like the houses on the outskirts having some farm area behind them. I like that. Has a nice feel to it, so probably gonna do a potato field and some carrots somewhere. And when the new update comes, a beet farm as well. So, um, actually today, while we're running by our new lumberjack that we built last episode, was it last episode? Oh, I'm pretty sure it was last episode. Um, I got a name for him. And the name will be... Gerald. Gerald Root Wood. Not a Root. Root. Root Wood. Gerald Root Wood, the Lumberjack. Yes. I like this name. And I think it fits pretty good. So, over there, the new lighthouse. I had the plans to do this um, quite a bit earlier, actually. Right when I built it, I said, well, we have to connect the two parts now and then build the house for the lighthouse. This is like the light for the lighthouse, so we need a house to be at the lighthouse. But yeah, um, I finally connected those two parts. So we had the upper part just straight shooting up from over there and it looked kind of out of place to be honest and I wanted to change that and now I finally did 
and I really enjoy what has happened. When I'm building towers, especially with stone blocks, I tend to go kind of fantasy and have like these weird, oops, um, these weird angles in there and interesting st structures and stuff like that. And I try not to overdo it over here, and I really like it. And I especially like like this corner piece, how there's like this. Uh, it's pretty good. I like it. And over here will be the actual lighthouse. I just um, thought of an outline what to have here. Uh, the block choices will be similar to that. I don't have a design yet, but uh, it will be over here. Um, this part will be open, so you can come in with a boat and park it in here. And I think this will be pretty cool. A nice start for our little haven port thingy that we're gonna build back here in this cove with the style of the tradesmen that take care of all the oceany stuff and that connect the different land masses here in fire scar all right now i already mentioned before the uh, new update that will come and actually uh, searching for the end portal is kind of preparation for that I hope the new update will come in the near future and I actually get something new to do. That would be awesome. And yeah, in the new update there will be a new end fight and new stuff to get in the end and actually a new part of the end dimension and all that kind of cool stuff that I want to be prepared for. So when the new update finally hits, I don't have to find the end portal and do all the stuff that I could do right now. But that's why we're gonna... So that's why we are going to go out and search for the end portal. That sounded really weird. That's why I stopped talking there. I... Actually, I was uh, saving up on ender pearls for the whole time that I was playing on here and when I did the wither fight reckless as I am or well actually because I died I just came back grabbed ender pearls went back in lost all of them went in again lost all of them and I had none left so <laughs> I had to start completely new farming those up I actually don't know how many we have right now I know we have some down in the storage. There are none here. None there. None there. And zero over here. Perfect. Let's get some place. Why do I have so many place rods? Oh, right. When I was farming for Wither Skeletons, I got all that. All right. Let's quickly go down there and get some of the Ender Pearls, turn them into Eyes of Ender, and get on with our journey. And grab some food while they're at it, actually. Running kind of low. I've started to level up quite a bit, as I'm just seeing over there, like over my axe, I'm level 39. And... Honestly, I don't really need anything right now to enchant. I might just go on an enchanting spree anyway, but my armor is alright. My w tools and weapons are alright. And... I don't know. Somewhere in here. Nice. Seven, that's good. You belong over here, though. Not that I will ever have that many or that much gunpowder, but... Let's have it over there. Wait, don't I have a dedicated ender pearl chest? I have. I do. Nice. That's pretty good. Let's get some food. Bonk. Let's make it a full stack. And uh, let's leave. So, what are your... What are you guys' thoughts? Where will the end, the portal be? I 
think spawn is that direction. So mm, I'm I'm pretty sure we moved quite a ways away from spawn. So the stronghold will probably be kind of in the direction of spawn. I'm guessing. Not sure, but it'll probably be. Yes, it is. Good. And we got the eye back. That's pretty good too. I just thought about that I should have made myself some speed potions. That would have been really helpful. Right, cows? Yes, yeah. They totally agree with me. Ah, uh, well, too late now. I'm off already. Let's see. Should we go on top of the mountain or throw it before? Let's throw it over here. It's over there. How cool would it be for the uh, stronghold to be actually below one of the Twin Brother Mountains? That would be really cool. Brown sheep. I still can't get over how many sheep I have in my world. Everywhere. So weird. Right? Sheeps agree with me. Sheeps? Wow. Great English. Great English. Alright. Uh, let's throw the next pearl when we're through the mountain. I just love this place. I gotta build something over here. I don't know what yet, but I will. It's way too cool to not build anything here. Alright. Back there is the village. It's probably dead by now. I've been around here so long that probably a lot of zombies spawned there. And got rid of everything over there. I have the feeling the angle changed on us. So we must be getting close already. Let's eat. Oh, I could have taken my horse. Wow, I'm really smart today. Hmm. Let's run through here. Get up there. Okay. Let's throw another eye. Still that direction. Are you kidding me? <gasps> Music. This this music re makes me feel really nostalgic. A lot of the times, it's so nice and so calm. I love it. Honestly, I did the whole 69% joke with the sound levels, but it's too loud, I'm sorry. <laughs> At least too loud for me, I don't know how loud it will be in the um, recording, but... It's too loud in my ears! No, it's fine though. Nice little backing. I recently looked into uh, getting some music ready to put into my like, Let's Plays to have like some background music usually, or most of the times, which would be really cool. Oh, we passed it! Nice! Oh, chattered. But... It will be somewhere over here. So that direction. Oh, the animation is pretty cool, but I don't have a lot of pearls. Again, the animals agree. How did you get up here? <laughs> animals agree with me again. Okay, this one dropped. Where? Where is it? Got it. See. 
there's the mountain, so... It's actually really close, it's so cool. Why am I getting up there? Oh, I'm sure, don't bring any blocks with you. Smart boy. Okay, got that. Put you back. We don't want to be an Enderman. Okay. Didn't I throw one a pearl around here? Where are you? Come back to me. There you go. So it's probably around here. I think if I dig down here, it should be alright. Shouldn't it? Like right here? This is where I went up, right? Up, right? Whatever. I think this is the place. Right here. Yep, it goes down. So this is where we want to be. Let's get on our digging game. Okay. Kids, never dig straight down unless you are a professional. And I'm definitely a professional. Right? Totally. Let's get some light though. Quickly dig down. There's some sun. And there it is already. Wow. Wow, it's really high up. Hi. Boop. Nice that it's... I really didn't expect it to be so close to home. Let's take a look around. Hey. It's one of those halls. Shut up. There's an enemy, man. Hey. Come here. Get it. <laughs> Couldn't hit him. Oh. Okay. It's good. Ooh, a chest. An apple and some redstone. Now that's a good chest. Screw you. It's not a chest. Rotated it the wrong way. Okay. Keep on going. Nothing over here. I didn't bring any coal, so I only have four torches left. Good shit. Hmm. Okay. Mm hmm. Where is the portal? Okay, let's try to find the portal. Uh, I would say. Well, the pearl kind of led us into the direction over here, so the portal should be around here, shouldn't it? Like, somewhere back here. Somewhere up there? Hi. That's weird. I don't think the struggle continues in this direction. Don't put a torch. We don't have anything to make new ones. Thanks. That's weird. Let's continue over here. New. Huh. There's nothing down here. Where's the portal though? There it is! Found it! 
And, wow. Wow. We need 11 eyes of ender. We don't have that much. Let's put in the ones we have. And leave the last one when the update comes. But... Wow. We found it. Shut up. Ow. Asshole. But yeah, this is pretty cool. Ooh, the library. Hi. Uh, ow. Oh, it's you. You hit me into the cobweb. What a guy. I'm trying to find the... Ladder. It's over here. Meh. Let's get up here. Hi. On the chest. And paper. Not as useful as I thought. There's another chest. So let's get that. Whoop. A book and an empty map. Hey, cool. We can map out the fire scar. Or, well, iron rivets for now. I actually didn't think of that. Nice. Yeah, I don't see any more chests over here. Alright, let's get out and make the chest... The chest? And make the map of Iron Rivers. Where did we come in? Well, actually, let's screw where we come in. Let's build up somewhere over here. Maybe not right on the portal, but like here. And with some blocks, I actually want to have a torch for that. Give. Thanks. So, if there is gravel falling, we don't die immediately. And also, you see something. Let's dig up. It's dark, I know. But don't be afraid. The children. Oh boy. I wonder what Iron Rivers will be or will look like on the map. Alright. It's re really close to the surface and really close to our home. And really close to er actually everything. It's cool. How cool would it have would have would is wow wow let me try that again how cool would it would it have been yeah that's right how cool would it have been that sounds wrong though well anyway you know what I mean if I actually built Iron Rivers directly on top of this stronghold how cool would that have been. Pretty amazing, if you ask me. But who would do that? Right? Oh boy. I'm excited. I really wanna want the uh, update to come now. Well, um, we are all waiting on the new update for quite a while now. I could play one of the snapshots, but I want to wait for everything to be finished. So cool. So cool. I love my, I love my map. And, yeah, play around with the new features when they're properly implemented. I'm trying to avoid the big spoilers. Um, I obviously know some of the features that are about to come, but... Yeah, I don't try to get into detail on all the mechanics that will be there, because I want to figure some of that stuff out myself. That's always fun. One thing that I know for sure, though, I will not build something with the purple blocks. No purple! Not for me. Never. What the fuck? They look ridiculous. In a really bad way. Well, I actually 
thought about changing the texture just to a red version of it. Like, have the same kind of texture but just red. I would probably use them then. That would be pretty cool. Maybe I'm still gonna do that, but probably not. I want to keep the texture pack as vanilla as it ca can be. Or... Yeah. Yeah, I think you get what I'm saying. Okay, let's go over to the Ale of Vane and open up the map and see what's gonna happen. I don't know. I feel like I did this once before. But I actually don't think I have. Whatever. Stop rambling. Make it a map. Oh. Well, that worked out great. Let me... I don't have enough paper on me. Well, let's make that one bigger. We have what it's... What is necessary. Let's do it. I don't think I have done an episode like this in quite a while. I'm just straight recording it. Like, from start to finish, no cuts. That's... Interesting. Hasn't done in a long time, but... Well, I, I did some stuff off camera, so we're still gonna see that number going up. And try to remember it. Now, actually, before I do the outro, or not afterwards, like I usually do. And that did nothing. Scaling. Maybe now something happened. Now it's really big. That didn't work out as planned. Give me that. Let's screw that. Make a compass. Make a map. Bonk. There we go. That looks cool. Make it bigger. Did anything happen? Yeah, I think. Make it bigger. That's not big enough. So, let's make it bigger. And we still don't have a lot of... We don't have the settlement over there on this map now. So let's make it bigger. Does anything change? Like, are maps broken that much? I don't have any reeds left here. Oh boy, are they really that broken? I remember I had trouble when I did the whole end of season one thing, the roleplay kind of map video that I did. If you haven't seen that, check it out. It's episode 23, I think, what's next, ca I called it. I spent like, probably, <laughs> I don't know, 70 hours on that episode, so would be cool if you could check it out. And if I am uh, repeating this in, like from other episodes that yeah that episode is <coughs> that that episode is the video I spend the most time on ever. So it's much appreciated. If it gets at least a few views. Now well, let's try to To make this work again. That's the right one, right? Right. There's the music again. 
I actually planted those reeds to make more books so I can make bookshelves to put into these houses. And that did not change at all. And that did not change at all. I'm gonna do it again, but I'm quite sure what's gonna happen. It did not change at all. Alright, let's do the thing I did with the other map. So let's do twice in a row. And now it did something, and it's way too big. Well... I will try to figure something out with the maps, but this is useless. Well, anyway... I think I'm gonna end the episode over here. I actually have no idea how long I recorded, but... Next episode, we're gonna do something a little bit more um, productive than just running around. Although, that's pretty cool. Maybe we, maybe we work on the lighthouse, maybe we do something else. I have a few ideas and we're actually gonna go out in a bit and start a whole new project. Actually, I have a few in mind that we should start, but one will probably lead to another and... Yeah, that's that. I did it again. I forgot to look at the statistics in the video. So, let's do it now. I re I'm recording this again afterwards. We're now up to 5.44 days played. I think last time we were up to 5.17. So, going over to the calculator. We are now up to four to five point four four. We were at five point one seven, I think. Again, if it was anything else last time, then I'm sorry. Uh, but if it was five point one seven days last time, I've played zero point two seven days, which translates to. 388 minutes. So, what's that in terms of hours? In terms of hours, that's six hours. I played around six and a half hours but, uh, to do this episode and to do everything that you saw off camera. I probably even did something or some stuffs that. some stuffs? Some stuff that I didn't show you. But, yeah. On to you, Dave. Do your outro thing. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this episode. And I hope you check back with me next time. Next episode, next video of whatever it will be. And until then, see ya.